Hello, my name is Lily Wells, and I'm here to tell you all about Wiccanry. What you see here is called the pentagram, which is also known as the Star of Wiccans. The points symbolize spirit, water, fire, earth, and air. Many people say that the star is evil, which at first it wasn't. Back in the 19th century, people started using the star to represent the devil. People that make horror shows and movies often show that the star is evil, when in reality it's made for protection. By the way, no, the star doesn't scare demons. Yes, it might get them to stay away from that part of the house, but it won't scare them badly. Many Wiccans don't celebrate some of the holidays we celebrate. When we celebrate Christmas, they celebrate Yule. On Yule, they gather around the tree and stand in a circle and cast the four earth, water, fire, and air to give thanks to their goddess. They also do spells and light various types of candles for health, safety, and happiness. Here is the horned god. He is equal and different from the goddess. At the end of every ritual praising the horned god, they say, in the lady of the moon and the horned lord of death and resurrection. People say that back in 1959, that the horned god meant under god. The horned god may be the most common, but he's not the only one representing the Wiccan religion. There are also the green man and the sun god. During the time to pray to the horned god, also known as Papias, Girls and guys would dance naked in the woods, chanting different peace and praying spells. For example, one song they chant is called Animal Spirits. It goes like, Animal Spirits come to me now, vanishing spirits come alive. This is the Wiccan Raid. The Wiccan Raid is the statement that shows the main role in the system in the neo-pagan or Wiccan religion and related to other witchcraft faiths. A part of the raid mainly used is, and it harms none, do as he will. When you think about Wiccan clothes, what colors do you think they mostly have? I know most people think that they wear dark colors. If you're thinking that they most mainly have gray, black, or dark purple, then you're right. Many Wiccans wear black since it takes in the visible spectrum and shows nothing to the eyes. It also draws in all normal energies which can connect to nature and one's own powers. Many Wiccans are vegan. Wiccans don't eat meat since they believe that it violates the Wiccan read. If I harm none, do as he will. So many Wiccans decide to eat things like fruits and vegetables. Like I said though, many Wiccans are vegan, not all of them are. Being Wiccan and eating meat or eating vegetables and fruit is just a choice. When many people think of a witch's broom, they think of the witches or the Wiccans using the broom to fly, which in case is not true. Wiccans use the broom to sweep out the circle before you cast upon it. Other times they use the broom to sweep out any negative energies. Another reason the broom is used is for when the time comes for a wedding, the groom and bride jump over the broom, which was used to clean the circle which symbolizes them leaving all negativity behind.